Hey everybody, Scott Sprinter here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Thursday, February 6, 2020. Got a free pick coming up in college baskets where we've been hot. We'll get to that in just a moment. Hey, if you just want to give DocSports.com a trial run, it's a real cool way to do it. You click on the link below the video in the description box and you get yourself set up for a free $60 account, which you can use on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com or anybody else on the roster. Again, it's a free $60 account and all you got to do to get started, click on the link below this video. Red Hot in college basketball, we remain so. 2-0 with our premium picks yesterday in college baskets and 2-0 with our free picks. Nice 4-0 night college basketball overall. NBA, that's where we suffered the loss. We fell one game short of a sweep and uh, just on the wrong side in an NBA game last night, basically start to finish. We went into last night's NBA on a red hot run. We're still hitting 67% on our current run in the NBA. I do have NBA, I do have NHL on Thursday and you'll be able to get those plays over on my homepage at DocSports.com anytime after 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific. College basketball, another multi-game card. And uh, those plays, college baskets at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific, anytime after that over at DocSports.com. And by the way, with last night's 2-0 sweep at the premium picks, we are now hitting 61% with our college basketball sides, our last 74 college basketball sides. And that goes back almost two months now, back to around mid-December, a little bit after that. So it's been an outstanding run. 2-0 premium picks last night. 2-0 here with our free picks in college basketball. Uh, go check it out on Thursday. Don't miss out. Multi-game college basketball card plus NBA and NHL. Oh, a real quick note. I've been asked this a couple of times. Uh, the XFL, which begins Saturday, and trust me, I've been studying the heck out of this league. If you heard my uh, spot on Mad Dog Radio last night with Patrick Maher, we were talking a little bit of XFL. Uh, we've checked out the coaches, the philosophies, the quarterbacks, the entire rosters, the rule changes. I'm going to talk a little bit more about all of that on a video uh, likely on Saturday, so be sure to check that out. But the picks for XFL will be released at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific on Saturday for the entire weekend. As you know, there's eight teams, four games, and so those will be available Saturday morning for the weekend over at DocSports.com. Again, don't forget about Thursday's plays. We're red hot right now in college basketball, 67% in the NBA on our current run despite last night's defeat. All right, let's get to it college basketball free pick for thursday it's a late game 11 p.m eastern 8 p.m pacific it is the west coast conference clash between pacific and san francisco and we're going to recommend taking the points here as i speak it's an eight and a half uh pacific the underdog of course there tough spot for san francisco uh, they fought hard against gonzaga uh, in almost one they almost upset gonzaga they lost by four points by the time it was said and done and they've got a big date with byu next who most people have and they're including me have in their top 20 power ratings, and that's BYU. Uh, the Dons, you know, they built this decent record, but they're just 5-5 five and five in their last 10 straight up. Couple of problems about San Francisco. They're 235th in effective field goal percentage allowed on defense. And also, the, you know, they give up over 38% from the three-point line to their opponents. That ranks 343rd in college basketball. They have not bounced back well in recent history off a straight-up loss. In fact, in their last 14 straight-up losses, they've covered just three following those straight-up losses. So 3-11 and 11 against the spread. And as far as Pacific, they lost the first meeting this season. But the last three games between these two teams have been decided by a grand total of six points. They play a lot of close games, as you can tell, at least as of late. Pacific's extremely strong on the glass. Uh, they're pretty stingy when it comes to their own effective field goal percentage allowed on the defensive end. Uh, and the road team's been the way to go. As you see, a close series. Road team 5-1 and one against the spread last six. The underdogs uh, covered five in a row in this series. We're going to back Pacific. We like them in this spot. Going to take the points with the Pacific Tigers on Thursday. Again, don't forget to check out our college basketball, NBA, and NHL at DocSports.com on Thursday as we look to stay red hot. Past last night in the NHL, we're back in action on Thursday. Thursday. Again, the free pick is Pacific in College Baskets Thursday night. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. And I'll be right back here on Friday by 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific. Let's put Thursday in the win column.